Good evening everybody. Just wanted to give you an update on mounting a 1.5 65mm Pwn CNC spindle with the VFD to my Millwright Mega V XL. So the 65mm mounts right where the Makita was and it's got an aviation connector. I've still got to route this up through the, the vacuum line and back around. Um, the PWM cable here, I routed it in through the back of the controller. I disconnected the laser output that I had. And this is the VFD. So right now I use the Open Builds control software. So when I go down here to Tools, and I go down to issue a M3S24000, Spin up to 24,000 RPMs. And then you can just do an M5, which is the tool off. And the M5, it goes off. But I will have this up running this weekend and carving some wood. And you can go back and just press stop. And if it's flashing, it's just in a standby mode. But uh, Daniel's got all this programmed. The VFD comes programmed. You do have to go in and change some settings in Open Builds Control to show that it's going to have a 24,000 max RPM and to turn the laser off in the Gerbil settings. Other than that, it's a fairly simple install. It took about an hour to pull the Makita out, um, put the spindle in, and basically wiring this up is very simple. You've got the uh, get your mains coming in from the wall. And then your connections for the aviation connection on the top. And the spindle itself is now grounded. So using the probe from Millwright, you don't have to use the red clip anymore. So you just touch it to that because the whole chassis is grounded through the connector, which runs back through the VFD and everything. But if you have any questions, just please post them below. Please like and subscribe. And thank you for watching.